The game's future stars are on Ladies display as minor league baseball Please comes your up. way on the Yo. show. Tonight, it's Flying. the first of three to start the Whoa. new week between the Bowie Bay Sox and the Flying. Let's play ball. Into the box now, James Newcomb. Day the off for him piece. yesterday, but back hey. out there for this one. Newcomb. Here's the first pitch to him. Hit in the air to right field. Moving under it, Blumenthal. He's got it, and there are two down now. Play ball. He's out. Three. Out. He's safe. Ready for another chance, James Newcomb. He flew out in his last at bat. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. Line drive to left. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the left field wall. You could hear the solid contact all the way up here, and I thought we were going to have our first run of the game right there. Gets all the way to the fence, but it stays in the park, so he'll have to be okay with a double. And digging into the batter's box batter. will be Hanser Alberto. He's 0 for 1 thus far. The 0-2 home. There you go, make the turn. Have a look. And there's one down now. Digging in the switch hitter, Javier Reyes. Right he reached on a eight. single in his first try. Oh, yeah. yeah, and they take another single oh, right yeah. here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. Digging in for his second at bat, Christopher the Bostick bat. comes into this at good. bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Bostick. Heading out towards get shallow off, right. See if it Blumenthal has a play, makes the play, and there are two gone now. And no tag at second. He'll head back there with two away now. Into the box now, now Shannon Schaefer. And we'll see yeah, what yeah. he can do here with a pair of runners Schaefer. on base and two gone here in the fifth. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Ready once again, now James batter. Newcomb. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat Newcomb. with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Reaches down and hits get this out, one on the out, ground to short. Out. Throw. Got him by a step. Would have been a run if he beat it out, but the inning is open. Now batting, James now batting. Newcomb Second in a pace. big at bat in this one. Hey. Two on, two away here in the eighth. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Ball one. In. Duke uses a split finger fastball as one of his weapons of choice in the arsenal. He can really be very deceptive when that pitch is working, and I'd imagine as a hitter, it's always in the back of your mind. Line drive to center field. You're scoring. You're scoring. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. At the plate, James Newcomb. There Second are base. two gone and the possible hey. go ahead run at first. Newcomb. Before the delivery, a no, check on that go ahead run at first. And he'll dive back in safely. Here's the first pitch. Tried to check it, and it's 0-1. Two out with the possible go-ahead run at first. Softly on a line to third. Find the ball. Find the ball. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So no runs here on a base hit. No errors in one. Striding into the box. Newton Tucker. No fielder. Newton. Now the one and one pitch. Sucker. One, Sent one, on one. the ground out to second. And there are oh. two away now. Well, we 
watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our top's player of the game. Yeah, it was a real good performance, as you'll see by his final line. Seven and two-thirds good innings, and in today's game, that's very solid. And that now one run held score. up tonight, First, one nothing the final. Healthy. The flying one squirrel. Time for minor league baseball here. Reggie Henderson will be on the bump for game two of the series. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, you always like to begin the season on a good note. In his first start of the year, he did just that, picking up. Coming to the plate now, James oh, Newcomb. Sucks. He'll get to take his first piece. cuts here. James. Now here's the Newcomb. pitch. On the screws to shortstop, but caught to retire the side. So they're held in check here this half. Into the box, Mauricio Ortega. 0 for 1 the for him baseman. here in this one. Mauricio Ortega. One, one, Hard one. on the ground towards second. Newcomb is up with it. On to Davis at first, and there are two away. Let's play ball. He's out. Ow. Striding in once again, now James that, Newcomb. He's 0 for 1 thus hey. far. Ready to deliver. Newcomb. Here's the first pitch. Fouled off. One out, nobody on. Well outside with the curveball for a ball. Inside with the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Shot toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Better way to square up on that ball. Great Outside job. Outside of home runs, nothing fires me up more than watching a good baseball player drive the ball at the opposite field. Talking about hitting the inside half of the baseball, that's exactly what happened right there. And when we say inside half of the baseball, imagine the ball coming to a complete stop halfway between home plate and a pitcher's mound. And then Third cutting base. that baseball in half and highlighting the inside half. That's where you're trying to take the knob of your bat or the ball hands one. to that spot ball, and right. carve the inside half of the baseball with power. Halfway to 100 pitches. Here it is. Slowly hit to first. I don't think they can get two. There's one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two, and it gets him out of... Now to the plate, James Newcomb. The he singled base. his last time up. He's set. Here it comes. Ah. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Stung into the gap in right go center hard, for what hard, should be hard, extra go bases. Come on, go, go, go. And a big insurance run comes around to score from first. It's a 2-0 ball game. Well, they already had the lead, but that extra run makes a huge difference. Even if it's only psychological, the pitcher knows when he steps out there that he has a little bit of wiggle room to work with. 
And digging into the batter's box will be Hanser Alberto. He's lined out and hit into a double play in his first two trips. The one two. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Rice takes charge and he's got it. Two down. Stepping in, Shannon Schaefer, runner in scoring position with two gone. Shannon Schaefer. Right here to the right. Rice takes it in. And the off-balance throw is right there for the third out and a high degree of difficulty. Now with the plate, James Newcomb. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get. Maybe once an A-B, maybe once a game. Well, as a former pitcher, you know I love these low-scoring games as opposed to those slugfests. Minor League Baseball is live and on the and air on the show tonight, the first of this four game weekend set God. between the Harris. Tommy Thomason gets the ball for the opener in front of these hometown fans. What do you have for us on him, Danny? Hey, this guy has a four. Set to get his evening at the plate started, Elijah Valentin. And it's been a real Elijah. struggle for him with the bat so Valentine. far this year. Things turned around in a hurry. Reined in. One there. On to first, but not in time as he beats it out. At the plate, Alex Tejeda. And he is off to a dreadful start at the plate as he has not hit the ball well at all in the month of April. All the second, this could be two. Right to him. To second for one. On to first, but not in time as he's in there ahead of the throw. They couldn't turn the inning-ending double play. They just get the force out at second. Digging in, that James Newcomb the comes in basement. after a day of rest Yay. yesterday. So we'll see if it did him any good. Yeah. And that's on the outside corner for a strike. Bases are empty, one man out. High fly ball out to straightaway center. 
Hernandez moves over. He hauls it in without any trouble. And there are two away. At the plate, Maury McConnell. He got called out on strikes his Maury. last time through. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system, especially now. Bear down. He gets the Oh, and he can't pick it up cleanly. And a good effort as he's able to gather it in and make the play for the first out. So the lineup flips over and digging in. John Lopez. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. The 1 2. 2 2 2. Scooped up on the backhand. Throw on to second for the force, and the side is retired. So digging in now, James Leading Newcomb. He flew out off. in his last at bat. The second baseman. 50th pitch hey. of the game on its way. Drilled Newcomb. on the ground is short. And that's the first out. Digging in now, Alex Tejeda. He got on top of one and was a Alex. ground out victim last time. Working for the punch out and the off one, one, one. late square and this is popped up Hitchcock is there and he has it for the out so no runs no hits no air. now at the plate James Newcomb the second baseman Yay. ready with the first pitch here it Newcomb. comes a ball and no oh, strikes no bases are empty here with two men out. Starts to go oh, around, but the home plate umpire says he held up ball two. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. And this one scoots all the way to the wall. And your go-ahead run is in there at second base as he's got himself a two-out double. I'll tell you, that's one of the first good swings we've seen anybody put on this guy so far. He's been throwing the ball really well, but that was one of the few mistakes we've seen him make. Striding in, Javier the Reyes. He's 0 eight. for 2 thus far in this Javier. one. Reyes. Ready with the payoff pitch. Yep. And this misses here for ball four. Just the second walk he's issued here into his seventh inning of work. And as a pitcher, that's always tough. Looks like he got a bad break on some of those calls, but he's got to learn that sometimes the calls don't go your way and you've just got to move on. That's something that young pitchers can have a hard time with, though. Now batting. The now in the box, hitter. Christopher Bostic. Two outs and two Bostic. runners aboard here in the seventh inning. Run this hard, is line to left. You're scoring, you're scoring, and you're that scoring. is down for extra bases. Is that ought to play the go-ahead run and maybe another? And he's in there safely as two runs come across to score and they grab the lead. Well, that's a huge base hit right there, dear. We're getting late into this one and that gives them the lead by two. Yeah, that could be a backbreaker right there. We'll see how this one ends up, but nice job to get that knock right there to drive in a pair. Now at the plate, John Lopez. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down couple one, runs. One, one. You know that old slogan, a boop and a boop. They could certainly use that right now. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number. Stepping into the box, now Thomas Hobrick. The they're quickly down to their Hobrick. final four outs here tonight. Hobrick. Straight up, straight up. High pop-up. Hitchcock is under it. But the second baseman calls him off and makes the catch. And that ends the inning. So here's the cleanup hitter, Scott Cadamer, due up for the four, five, and six hitters, and they're hoping that the this is the base. part of the lineup that yeah. can get something going. Cadamer. Yeah, only one on the board one, so one, far one. for them. They just haven't had consistently. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. It's always nice to take the opener of a four-game set with your home. That sets the stage for the rest of the series, and it gives you a good springboard the rest of the way. Tonight's ball game comes to a close.